What's up, everybody? It's your boy D C the. <sighs> Welcome in the Hater Nation, guys. We are going to talk about this in DC's Coach's Corner, and I want to know more about your opinions. We're going to talk about clicking off. Should you click off? Should you stay on and make the tackle? Does it mean that you're a pussy if you don't, or you're a punk ass biatch if you don't? What does it really mean? We're going to talk about it here. And should you do it, or should you should you just stay on and try and make the tackle? All right. We're going to go ahead and get into this. But before we do, if you would hit that subscribe button, I don't know if anyone's told you, but like, and the subscribe button is 100 free so go ahead and hit that subscribe button for your boy turn on that bell so you never miss a dc's coach's corner we are here to help you as well guys i do stream every monday wednesday thursday and saturday sometimes my schedule's been kind of hectic getting ready to move but we are trying to stream as much as possible come out to the hater gang my, my guys out there they hate hard you know come out and see me at dc the god all right so let's go ahead and get into it all right the question that we all want to know should you click off and should you feel like a pussy or a punk ass biatch if you do okay let's go ahead and look at these two plays here this was fourth and six um against my opponent i ended up winning the game but this is fourth and six i am using i normally use jordan poyer or taylor mays depending on which one i want to use her um in the field of play i think jordan poyer is a hidden he's a hidden a hidden uh pup you know what i'm saying like Power up, I think he's just as good as a Taylor Mays usering wise with no abilities. Um, but we're gonna go ahead and get into this play here. And my man, my guy decides to run the screen. And I'm looking to come up. I immediately notice it's a screen. So I back off. I run into the guy, which I'm fine with. I should have run into him. All right. So I, I try and get into an empty space so I can go ahead and shut down the screen. And then I move my character up. Okay, I move my character up because I want to get in tackling position. All right, so I'm running over to make the tackle. All right, right here is when I hit the A button. All right, so I have two decisions. I either hit A or I can click off, which is the B button. I don't even let you know, I don't even click off. I don't, I don't think that you're a punk if you click off. I'm just going to say that. I don't think that. Right. I do want to know, though, it, it, let me know in the comment section how you feel about it. Do you think that you a punk ass biatch if you click off or do you think that, hey, it is what you should do because the game does not allow you to make tackles? My opinion has absolutely changed watching these two plays. So I went to go make the tackle. I hit the A button here and I just want you to watch what Jordan Poyer does. Jordan Poyer takes two steps. While he's literally, <laughs> I didn't even notice that. While he's really just looking at the guy blow by him, all right, he just tackles at absolutely nothing. He goes to tackle the the the, the, the thirty five yard line. Like really, you tackling the thirty five yard line? Like who are you tackling here, buddy? So I like I'm telling you, like I legit hit the button here because why would I hit the button here? That doesn't even make any sense. I hit the button here when I was close to my guy, and the game just says, nope, you're just gonna tackle the thirty five yard line because we're we, we don't really care. Okay, we don't we don't really care about your soul. All right, so that is the first play. I wanted you guys to see absolutely irritated at that. It's just like, bruh, like y'all just gave him the first down. So the very next play, same thing. I'm on Jordan Poyer again here. We'll go ahead and go to Jordan Poyer. I come out, all right, and this nickel 335, the whole purpose is, is to to get the gap. So I'm, I'm right here. I'm going to go ahead and shoot the gap. I'm coming around and right here, I hit the A button. Okay. When he's right here, I'm hitting the A button. Now I heard spamming the A button works. I haven't really tested that out. I'm just A button, try and get to secret tackle. I'm not trying to hit stick. Okay. If I hit stick and miss, I'm fine with a hit stick and miss. I'll take a hit stick and miss because I'm trying to hit a big hit on the guy. I just want to tackle him. I just want to get him down. Two yard game, right? I'm cool with a two yard game. So here I'm going to, to hit it. I hit the button. My guy takes two more steps and he just literally tackles at nothing. Wow. Once again, he's looking at him the whole entire time. <laughs> like, look at him. He's looking at Jim Brown, just literally just run right in the, the biggest hole where he should have had the tackle. And when I hit the A button, my guy just tackles at air. Oh, I think that'd be a dope ass thumbnail. I think we're gonna make that the thumbnail right there. Uh, that right, there. <laughs> right there. 
Oh my god, just absolutely ridiculous though. Like, I mean, look at look at my man's here. Like, look at my man's. Look at my man's. Look at my man. Has should has should have a tackle. Real football, he would have had the tackle. If Jim Brown breaks the tackle, I'm fine with that. That's what should happen. Jim Brown on a safety, really, you should kind of break it because he's a he's a he's a big back. Okay, he should actually break that break that tackle, but he should slow him down enough in order for the safety back there, uh, Derwin James, to come up and make that play in order to stop. This is the kind of we'll show you a clip. I want to show you a clip um, here from Ryan Clark and how he was discussing with Troy Palomalu, right? Goat, goat of of DBs. I, I don't know. I just I, I'm a fan of Troy. Uh, kind of really want to. You know what? I might get Troy this weekend for my team. Anyway, but goat, right? So, uh, Troy Palomalu, I feel like was a goat. He was talking about. We'll show this clip right here. A uh, 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 Clark. God, what is his name? Ryan Clark. Ryan Clark. Ryan Clark discussing with Troy, Troy Palomalu about tackles and DBs tackling running backs. Good running backs. So. I understand it. We'll show the clip right here. Like right now, I'm stressed out because I got to tackle Adrian Peterson. Me and Troy <laughs> sitting here talking like, say, bro, are you, you going to cut him? Or maybe like, you know, we could just bracket him every time we come up to him. Or listen, you go low, I'll go high. Like we're having this conversation. And as you've seen in that clip, like he's, he's discussing, I mean, he was talking about something else about kickers, but he was really discussing like how they are going to attack Adrian Peterson. Like how they're going to tackle him, right? So here, I understand. He should make the tackle and make an effort. If he gets if he gets a, a break a broken tackle because it's Jim Brown, yo, I'm okay with a broken tackle. This is Jim Brown going up against the DB, and that kind of stuff should happen. And guess what you would do? Hey, EA. EA. You would you you would make the linebackers important again. Just saying. It's really that like, they are supposed to tackle. Not DBs, but hey, it's the game that we play, right? The game that we play says, hey, DBs can still tackle running backs. That's 100% fine. Linebackers are useless. <laughs> All right, linebackers are useless in Madden 21. It just, it just is what it is. So as you see, my man just tackles at, you know, nobody. He tackles, he tries to tackle Hyde, uh, tackle Hyde and offensive lineman and just, just, it's just, ugh, ugh. But all right, that's pretty much it for the video, guys. It's your boy DC. Always remember, embrace the hate, and I mean hate everybody.